Two Native American hunters went to court Friday for an incident that happened in November. The Leech Lake band members were trying to catch a deer for food during the tribe's fall hunting season. They shot it on land owned by the band, but it escaped onto private property where the hunters tracked it down. An unnamed person on this property called the police. Minnesota was granted limited civil, civil and criminal rights over tribal land in 1955, but attorney Frank Bibbo says the men who both appeared in court are innocent because of 1825 Chippewa Treaty rights, which take authority over those There's rules. A boundary. It set a boundary from Michigan over to North Dakota, and it says the Chippewa decide who hunts north of that, and the Lakota, the Sioux, decide who hunts south of that. In 1826, they had a ratification session by Duluth in, on, on uh, Lake Superior, and at that session, we agreed to let them come in and look for minerals and carry them out. And in that treaty, it says, we still retain jurisdiction and title to the land. Bebo says the case will likely be taken to federal court. He believes treaty rights will be recognized and says he expects Leech Lake and Minnesota to enter a consent agreement in the end. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.